birds and planes, and he'll run under, he'll run under you and hide. Because he sees the planes. If you don't know, if you can get these guys on the web at www.dunschool.com.au. Thank you very much. Okay. <laughs> Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Craig Murray, and this is Tracy Murray, and we're from Craig A. Murray Dog Training. This afternoon, we would like to give you a demonstration of a laptop assistance dog. You'll notice that we have Ernie here, who was a rescue from the AWL and the Welfare League, and he's about two and a half years old. Obviously, we teach them on something that they like, which is a toy, and then we turn it to much more realistic objects. You'll notice that Ernie has to come right back to Tracy's lap and give her everything in, his hand, in her hand. Like what people would need every day, a wallet. And again, this is quite a large object for Ernie, but we still expect him to pick it up, bring it right up to Tracy's waist. Or that. Think about picking up a credit card and ask a little girl to go and pick up, pick up a credit card off the ground. It's not always easy. Okay, and again, right up to the lap. We must do it every time up to the lap. So if Tracy were to drop something three or four times, she would expect him to pick it up every time and just keep bringing it up to her, whether she rewards him or not. Okay, so a credit card seems hard, but let's make it a little harder even You can see he's waiting for the command. So, keys are a little harder again, to pick something up off the ground like a 20 cent coin. Sometimes it can be quite hard. So imagine trying to do it with your lips or just your teeth. So Tracy's going to throw out the paper. And Ernie only gets rewarded for a good result. The tug. The retrieve. And then to go back and close the door by pushing with the nose, which is the nudge. Let's see. And he's not allowed to put it down until Tracy asks for him to put it into her hand. 